Hi, this is Steve Milano with the U.S. High School Tennis Association. If you've got girls who serve like this, you can improve their consistency, their depth, and their power without changing them to a loop serve. Now, many coaches are tempted to try and fix this serve by teaching females a continental grip, a 45 degree stance, and a loop motion. But unless the female has a mature throwing motion, which is used for serving, it's going to be almost impossible to learn a loop serve. You need to teach them how to throw first. It would be like me trying to serve left-handed. It looks like I'm coordinated, doesn't it? But now I'm going to try to serve a left-handed serve with a continental grip on a 45-degree angle. I'm going to serve a loop. I can get it in, but it's difficult. One quick tip you can give the girls is many of them talk just about racket height and they try to serve down. And even if it goes in, it barely goes in and it's very weak. If you can teach the girls to toss the ball about six inches above your racket, they're going to be able to get their weight into the ball. Oops, I just hit a loop serve. If you teach them to throw above the racket, they'll get their weight in the ball. And look at how much deeper the serve is going. And I'm getting more weight into the ball. And I'm hitting up. Those are pretty good serves. Now, you want to teach the girls that they want to pretend that they're hitting the bottom of the ball up instead of the top of the ball down. That would look like this. Hit the bottom of the ball up. Now, you're actually going to be hitting the back of the ball, but this will force them to swing up. And you would have them start at the service line to practice this. Now, some of the girls aren't going to believe that you can hit a tennis ball up and make it go into the court. So you're going to demonstrate, watch this, I'm going to hit this ball up, not down. They may say, I didn't see that. What you can do is this. I'm going to hit this ball up. Well, my racket was above the net. Maybe I'm cheating. What about this? Is there any way I can hit the ball down from here and make it go in? But in order for it to go in the service box, I'm going to have to hit a pretty wimpy serve, aren't I? So that will demonstrate you can hit a pretty powerful serve by hitting up. And that is your quick tip. That's your quick tip for the frying pan serve. Have the girls practice tossing the ball six inches above the racket and trying to hit the bottom of the ball up. And if you have them practice from here, don't worry about it landing in the service box. They're just practicing this. And that's a very good quick tip for improving a frying pan serve without changing the grip, without changing the backswing, without changing the follow through, going to a loop, just getting the toss higher and hitting the bottom of the ball up or trying will get more weight into the ball, more power, more depth.